The man accused of killing two women a decade apart is closer to getting a trial date. 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake attended a hearing for Kyler Eust. She has the latest details. The murder trial for Kyler Eust may start this spring in March or April. Eust appeared in court today, clean cut, emotionless and wearing a mask. Eust is charged in the deaths of two young women a decade apart, Kar Kapetsky and Jessica Runyans. Their remains were found in the woods in rural Cass County in 2017. This case has been plagued with ongoing discovery issues, but today the prosecution and defense say they've made a lot of progress and believe they have every document from the Belton Police Department, which oversaw the investigation into Kar Kapetsky's disappearance. Both the prosecution and defense are trying to find out more about a GPS tracker that was put on use car around 2007 when Kopetsky vanished. We don't know what information came from the GPS tracker, so the prosecution is working with the Belton Police IT Department to find the daily reports that tracker generated. Runyon's disappeared in 2016. She was last seen leaving a party with used. 41 Action News obtained the recent court documents filed in this case, which include a filing on September 8th to allow the defense's medical experts access to the girls' skeletal remains. Today, the defense claimed that a man in federal prison confessed that he killed Kara Kapetsky. However, the prosecution maintained that that is not true. It's all hearsay. There is another hearing coming up on October 5th at 2.30. Judge Collins says he wants all of these loose ends tied up so they can set a trial date. I'm Sarah Plake, 41 Action News. Thanks, Sarah. Eust was supposed to go on trial last month, but due to COVID-19, that was put on hold.